Hey, welcome to Smartbots. We are a conversational AI company and we help enterprises in adopting chatbots and virtual assistant solutions. In this video, we are going to look at a virtual assistant, a chatbot that is trained to address banking customer queries. The customer support division strives to provide 24/7 support to their customers. This virtual assistant augments the efforts of the support agents by offloading the common requests and letting the agents focus on queries that are complex and need human attention. The virtual assistant is already trained with thousands of real conversations from the banking domain. Adding to this, the virtual assistant is powered by strong language understanding and dialogue management engines. The assistant can thus contain more queries and provide a great customer experience. Let us take a quick look at this virtual assistant. I have here a sample web portal of a financial institution. At the bottom of the page, we have a little chat icon that opens up the virtual assistant. This is the virtual assistant that is trained to answer questions on banking transactions. I'll demonstrate a few scenarios here. The first one is where the transfer is not received by the recipient and the user wants to know what the reason is. So I type out the question saying that I did a transaction but my friend hasn't received it yet and I want to know why. The bot is now asking me the account number from which the transfer was made. I type in the account number. It now asks me the pay name. I enter in the name Mike. It's asking me the date of the transaction now. I type in yesterday and it understands the date automatically. It confirms the amount with me. It's checking which type of a delivery is it. So this is where it gives me the details of the transaction. So looking at the next example, here is a situation where the user has an unknown transaction in the account and he wants to report the same. So he's typing in saying that there's a withdrawal showing that he doesn't recognize. The bot first asks for the account number from the user. The user types in the account number. Now to validate the user, the bot is asking for the date of birth. Once the user is validated, the bot is suggesting for change of credentials, passwords and pins and it asks per permission to freeze the compromised account and the user says yes and a request has been raised for freezing the account. So the next example is a situation where the user is not able to receive cash from the ATM and he wants to know why. So the user types in to the virtual assistant asking why he is not able to get the cash. So as usual the bot first tries to validate the user by asking the account number and the date of birth. Once the user is validated the bot will ask a series of questions about the transaction. And now it gives a list of uh, probable reasons why the cash was not dispersed. The bot asks whether that could be one of the reasons. The user says no. And now the bot has taken down a request in the backend. If you found this interesting and would like to know more, you can check out our website smartbots.ai. Thank you for watching.